So my name is Rodrigo Aguayo, I'm a senior and I play bajo sexto. My name is Enrique Aguayo, I'm a senior and I play the accordion. So uh, it was in elementary school. Um, I started off in fourth grade. It was a small elementary school orchestra program, uh, public funded. Uh, after that, it was getting into, I guess, the music, uh, Mexican music. It was uh, it was always played in my in my home, and uh, my uncle Menu actually uh, gave us the, our first accordion, which I ended up giving it to him. And uh, I had a guitar that my dad had taught me how to play, so that's when we started playing together. Want to get an input? As for me, I uh, started off in the second grade playing the clarinet. I didn't stick with that very long. I uh, jumped onto the trumpet. That was its own adventure. Uh, and it wasn't until I was 13 where my uncle gave us the accordion and I actually found something that I liked. <laughs> Um, I'll take it. Uh, music has been a uh, part of our family. Obviously, we're brothers. Uh, my dad's been the one that's always told us to uh, to do something really fun. He wanted us to. We've done sports, but music is the one that stuck throughout the the years. And uh, he actually played guitar before I did, and seeing him play and the enjoyment he was getting out of it made me want to just start playing and do something on my own as well. I would say that each, because we played in a few multicultural graduations here at Texas State, it's uh, surprising how we may be at the on campus that we don't realize how many other Hispanics are are among us. But when the multicultural graduation hits and we play some of Ramon Ayala, everybody gets out of their seat, they start singing, and it it's not like we're performing. It's like we're part of a, a whole family. And that's for me has been great, you know, multicultural. Uh, one of my most most memorable moments would be uh, it was about two summers ago where uh, Tejano singer Michael Salgado was here, and we asked if we can sing a song on stage with him. At first, he thought we were just gonna sing, but when I asked him if I can play his accordion, he was he was willing to let me use it, and he flipped it over. He's a left hand player, flipped over with a right hand, and it was a pretty good experience. <laughs> Oh, you it, was, it was well, given. Our, our parents, <laughs> uh, but it was kind of adopted to us. We were we had some names as a band back in the day. We were Eminencia, Conejo, named after an uncle, and uh, down here we pretty much didn't have a name. And one of our advisors wanted to call us. Uh, I think at one point we were the Swipes. Uh, we were Los Bobcats. Del Norte. Los Bobcats del Norte. Los Bukis de San Marcos. Uh, yeah, it was it was a it was just given. Uh, Honestly, we didn't even perform, but someone figured out that we played. And after that, they were like, hey, can you come to this event? Can you come to another event? And music was something that was in our past. We were just mainly focusing on our education, I guess I would say. And uh, it just again, and we've been doing it ever since, hopefully in our last multicultural graduation this uh, May. Check us out. Hey.